the stereotypes I've heard uh, kind of like the fighting, the rowdiness, and the athletics. And so that's a positive stereotype, but uh, still very general. Through the news, we are portrayed as a school that is violent. Most people view it as, you know, bad, a lot of violence here. That we're violent. Um, we, you know, we're in the news a lot. We're only in the news for negative things. You go to the doctor, the doctor asks you where you work. I teach at Woodland Hills. Oh, are you okay? Or, I'm sorry. When I say sometimes that I teach at Woodland Hills, they kind of feel that it's a rough, or rough and tough uh, high school. Um, I think the reputation of Woodland Hills is probably the same as McKee's Ward. Like, they just think that guys probably like, get in the fight. My perception now is I think we get a bad rap. I really do. I think the, it's because of how the media portrays us. We're really not as bad as, as everybody thinks we are. There's all kinds of stereotypes. That's the, what they do about us. What they don't understand is how wonderful the education is and how funny and wonderful our kids are. You just, you just, I just think that you hear a lot when this happens in Women Hills. There's a lot of things going on at the schools that they just don't report. Uh, having set my own children through here, uh, we hear it all. And I'll tell you where my daughter heard it the worst when she went to college. Her roommate called, like my roommate, when I and when I went to college, my roommate heard I was from Wilkinsburg, and she, Sharon got the same call that I did. Are you, are you, you from where? You're, and after about 10 minutes, she said, are you white? <laughs> Why did you start We Love the World Night? Um, I just, I mean, I have myself have a passion for, like, different cultures, so last year I just kind of thought of the idea, knowing that Woodland Hills is a diverse school, if we could just have a night to celebrate that. You know, when people ask me, well, is race an, an issue at your school? It really isn't because our students have grown up together and they're willing to work together. We're diverse in our experiences and diverse in our relationships, but together we make a stronger whole. They might fight in the beginning, but they're going to start to see that they're like the same people and actually come together as one and maybe stop the violence. Considering that our school district doesn't get that great of you know, publicity.